Hello, uh, Milsim fans out there, and yes, I've got a terrible cold, absolutely stinking cold. Now, it's been a while since I've played Squad. Um, I don't know, maybe the uh, advances in um, the updates just weren't enough for me at the time. But um, yeah, it's actually gone into alpha phase, and uh, more people are in now, and uh, a lot of the servers are full. And I've probably had about three weeks rest from this game, and you know what? It has improved a massive amount. Honestly, they've they've really done in those three weeks. There is a lot being added. Even icons down on the compass at the bottom. There's a new uh, map system. There's a new role and everything uh, for picking new roles and squads. There's now icons for everything. There's new audio, uh, new effects. There are bandages on screen as you can see right now. So they really have added a lot to it, and the game feels certainly a lot more visceral at this stage. It really is great to come on and see the server list being full, in fact there are two servers for London now, whereas in the past it got to the point where on the forums people were saying, where is everybody, there's nobody even playing anymore, and uh, that's changed, hopefully it's going to stay that way as a lot of new players are coming in from Steam, and uh, the game just seems to have a new life to it, uh, the engine's actually been updated as well to the latest version of the Unreal Engine, so it certainly feels uh, it feels different to, to a couple of weeks ago at least. <laughs> Right, Quick, injured. Can you run over here? Ah, uh, me too. Right, just watch the door. Shit. Comes out, 360. Ragged. Compound to the west as well. Ragged. Not sure what happens to this guy on the right, it's almost like he kills himself with the bat blast. You're about to see him on the right hand side now. I don't think anything hits him. I <laughs> don't know what that was about. Um, yeah, and I'm just about to turn around and get myself a nice ragged with the 203. Brilliant. The behind us, the behind us! Oh, he took that 203 straight to his bloody ragged. Fucking ragged. Now what has surprised me in this latest update, now that it's been opened up to a lot more people, is there's definitely a lot of team play. This is something that was lacking uh, in, a, in a lot of times in the older versions. Um, everybody seems to be using a mic, the squad leaders are trying their best to organise between the squads, tactics and things like that, and they can see the map on screen. I do think that the newer players shouldn't pick the squad leader role, uh, because the game can be quite confusing, even when you've been playing the game for a while, especially with the new updates, things change, new icons, things like that. So, while it's good that they're wanting to take these roles, quite a lot of new players are jumping in and just really not having a clue what's going on. So again, I really don't think they should be taking the squad leader role, but, you know, it's a learning process and uh, with them all having different classes, people want to get in and start being a leader and it's all good, but of course you need a mic. And, um, yeah, so far, I'm quite impressed with the community, the way it's coming. No dickheads are running and gunning and uh, the usual stuff that you get with a lot of the, these games. So, so far, fingers crossed, let's hope it improves as the updates come in and we get Humvees, vehicles, helicopters and everything else coming in, which should be absolutely brilliant. Who's popping smoke? Got enemies running along the far side of the river, south, towards the east. Now, just on a little side note, really, that's not really related to squad. I registered two keys for Rainbow Six Vegas months ago, and I also got an extra key from Nvidia. And I have not received an email in order to be played. So fuck you, Ubisoft. Go get fucked, you cunts. Honestly. I'm really angry about this. It's day fucking four now, is it? I haven't got it, and a lot of other people yeah, on the PC have not got their south, beta keys. Uh, the Ubisoft have extended the uh, beta. Well, what's the fucking point if nobody you can get in the fucking thing? Cunts, I hate them. 
absolutely hate them. I, I cancel my pre-order, I'll just buy it at a later time, because you're not getting my cash. If you're going to tell me you're going to give me the beta, <laughs> and then you're not going to send me the key, get fucked. You fucked me over on a Assassin's Creed, and now with this. Rant over, let's yeah, get back to, to squad. Put the squad. Bastards. Hold, hold your tiki and then there'll be an option. What you're looking at here is the new map screen and there are tools at the top so you can actually draw on this map for your squad. You can see where your squad mates are and you can uh, you know, give commands whether they follow them is another map. Immediately to his side, in the buildings to his side. Repeat last. Squad 3, they've got them immediately south of them. West, west, guys at the top of the ridge, west, west, enemies. Compound to the west, blow you. I do think the game has got massive potential. It's kind of a cross between armour and what could we put this between? Project Reality. It's kind of like uh, mixed into the middle. It is quite hardcore, I'm, I'm not joking. The aiming system is really... I mean even as you saw at the beginning of the video, even at 20-30 foot out you're not guaranteed to get a shot. Whether that's the recoil Everybody knows my opinions on the focus system, it just doesn't have enough zoom in for me, it's not clear enough, especially at 2k because everything gets smaller, and especially with the saw gun, you fire a couple of shots, I can't see what I'm firing at and it is really frustrating. Whether they will we'll introduce sights and scopes and things like that for the uh, support weapons, who knows, I know it's not the most realistic thing, but you can't see what you're shooting at, it makes it literally at the minute just a close quarters battle game for me which is is a pity really because the scope of the game and I think what the devs are trying to achieve is a real sort of squad based team based simulation game so I know it's not hyper realistic but it's it is got that nice balance between armor and um, yeah, did, yeah. well it's difficult you just it's one of these games where you just need to get in and play a lot of people absolutely love it it's got that sort of directly, military uh, degrees, realistic vibe Afghanistan and some of the maps are quite interesting We've and a lot of people just think it's too slow but they're probably used to the twitch shooters and things like that. Anyway I'll leave you to yeah, enjoy the rest of this footage, it's not that long. Uh, this has been the new update for the uh, squad, it's now in alpha, you can get it on Steam if you want to get in and try it and play it and I think you'll enjoy it. If you enjoy the team based shooters on military sim games then squad's probably the game for yeah. you. Thanks for watching, uh, I shall now go get myself a bloody lem sip like a proper trooper and I shall see you in some more videos coming soon. Thanks for watching, bye bye. We're already capping this. We got contact to the side Shots on the hill. hill. Nice, I'm moving up the hill. It's friendly, it's risky, it's friendly. Ah, nice. Guys, don't move too far away from it, we're not capturing it now. I move back down to the cap zone, guys. Take a position in a building or a roof or whatever, just hold it down. I would love deployables now for the saw bipod, that'd be amazing. Yeah, and I was hoping they'd have the Humvee, because I've seen the video of the Humvee where they were like showing it out. Well, internally, they've got all the 50 cal deployables and everything ready to go. They just neutralised our cap. For fuck's sake. Yeah, there's nobody there defending at all. What's the plan, squad? Should we get two or three of us to go back to the other location while the other three stay here? No, he's not. He's down, take her down. Alright, if we let uh, one of them go off. I 
got him, I got him, that's way. I'm a fucking mad dick, worry. We should watch our asses because they're going to start coming back from this point. Uh, we have to go back, they've neutralised it. I think squad one and a decent amount of us are moving towards it. We should maybe just stay here and stop them from recapping. Squads, we've captured that point. We can move on, move on to blue fob. Roger, yeah, I'll set up a fob now. Uh, the squad, where do you want the fob? <laughs> 